Yo, baby boomers. Welcome to uh, week five, Saturday, June 11th, 2011 of the greatest summer of my life. Um, now, last week's uh, uh, inspirational phrase was, um, I promise, this week, week's fives is, God remembers. All right? God's keeping score to all the haters out there and the naysayers. They, they don't matter. The only one that matters is up here, man. God remembers. Now, the reason I'm dressed like this is, as you people know, I was uh, expecting, and my goal was to lose uh, 40 pounds this first month, and I uh, today's the weigh-in that I'm doing today instead of the uh, 17th, which I'll tell you later. Let me get to that later. Stop interrupting me. <laughs> so anyways, I went to the, I just came back from the gym because that's the only scale that will hold me, and um, I, unfortunately, I did not reach my goal. I fell short. I'm a little embarrassed, and um, I fell short by uh, two pounds. Two, baby. Two, 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 two pounds. How's that, man? 38 pounds first month. I went from 448, all right, to 410. Who knows what's going to happen next month? Now, I know all the naysayers might be saying, hey, a lot of it's water weight. A lot of it was, and a lot of it's just the first week, first month. But we did, first four weeks, man, we're doing it every four weeks. But we did it by walking and drinking water, basically. All right? And then praying, breathing, believing, changing our lives, cutting stuff out one week at a time. It's pretty easy. It's pretty fun. And I'm pretty funny. <laughs> well, excuse me for losing 38 pounds the first month. Ha <laughs> ha! Let me take this off. What about these baby boomers that dress like this? We're supposed to grow old respectfully, right? This is my police academy hat. Everything works in it. You'll figure out why I was wearing that later. These glasses I want to get rid of. Let me just get my hair going here. And I'm at California. I'm at the beach. Beautiful Southern California. Losing all the weight this summer. Where um, the men are men. Some of the women are men. And some of the men are women. <laughs> I crack myself up sometimes. Anyway. All, this all started with week one, and um, this being the greatest summer of my life, um, we, we, we right now have in our, in, our, in our schedules where we're eating fruit, and then the second month, so we're eating fruit, we're eating uh, a salad every other day, we're eating vegetables, let's do two fruits, two vegetables, and uh, there's a salad every other day, and then just water, water, water. And um, now I'm at the fifth thing I gotta take away. It's week five, so I gotta take away number five. Because so far I'm pizza, pasta, bread, and rice. And the fifth thing, it's kind of a cop out because I, I I still like my beer occasionally. Man, I'm from Jersey, man. I'm a baby boomer, so I'm gonna hold off on that until towards the end. But uh, so I'm gonna get rid of this week uh, rice because I, I a lot of Chinese, and that means if you get rid of the rice, you gotta get rid of the Chinese food too because that's a lot so much sodium in that that's so bad. But anyway, so that's my fifth. You pick your fifth. And anyone who's just starting or believes now, because I did lose the 38 pounds, um, go back to week one. Start from week one. All right? And um, basically for our mind now, and, uh, well, you know, let's, let's start smiling again. It is our turn, baby boomers. But for our mind, uh, let's, because um, remember, it's mind, body, spirit. For our mind, try, let's start reading every day. I'm reading again every day, and I love it. And uh, for our soul, let's pray. And for our body, let's walk in lots of water. All right? And, um... The major difference with me that I say from week one to now is I don't feel as bloated, I don't feel as swollen, and it was like I was in chains, man. I was I was a prisoner, of, you know, of, of, of fat, and then now finally I can breathe. I'm free. I'm free. Hallelujah. So, um, baby boomers, this is our last stand, all right, and uh, do, do it for our children, do it for our loved ones, and do it for ourselves. Okay, that sounds that sounds really really good to me, and. Um, that's, uh, you know, a big thing is uh, God remembers, all right? And people continuously putting me down, doing all that. But we did 38 pounds, baby, in four weeks with no surgery, no drugs, all right? All these other people. That, I got people coming up to me now going, hey, if you try this, you'll lose it faster. Hey, I just lost 38 pounds in four weeks. Back off, baby! All right? We're going to teach people by example. You two out there. And excuse me. You know, when I was when I was a kid, I used to say, "Excuse me," and my brother would say, "There's no." My big brother would say, "There's no excuse for you." But anyway, chocolate, my favorite. We observe today not a victory a party. I'd like one ticket to Bountiful. Snap out of it! Stay alive in 
I will find thee. That movie was crazy, wasn't it? With Daniel Day Lewis. Anyway, so uh, another quick secret. Um, as you're walking towards the end of your walk, speed up your intervals. I'm now doing, literally, I'm doing, I did like an over an hour walk today where the first week I could only walk maybe under five minutes was the first week. I'm over an hour already. I'm smiling. I just got out of the shower. I was singing in the shower again. I haven't done that and I don't know how in too long since I've done that. And another another quick secret is speeding up uh, uh, the intervals to speed up. Another thing is um, listen to music. Music somehow helps. And then stretch and take deep breaths and all that. And uh, now I'd like to just thank, I did a radio show interview this week for a uh, Laura um, Dion Jones from Chicago, and it's WRM, 10.40 a.m., 3 to 4 Central Time. Look her up, Laura Dion Jones. She's a trailblazer. She's an amazing, beautiful woman who uh, does a, a whole thing on uh, nutrition and everything else every week on a weekly show. And after I did the show, my site, TonyLongo.tv, that has over 900,000 9, views, literally crashed because too many viewers on it at once, uh, the, the, my web guy said. So we got it back up and running. And then also... Um, uh, see you at the top .com is up and running or walking as we like to say all right and now um we got an out and I unfortunately have to announce that we're and I and, and um Tony TV is stupid scripted shorts really funny stuff go to it check it out check it out <laughs> get a tackle anyway um um oh, but, but then also the scale says 38 pounds is 38 pounds <laughs> 38 pounds so um Anyway, I'm, from here on in, though, I'm only going to do shirtless. I'm no more shirtless every week. I'm going to do shirtless in, like, week eight. Uh, I'll do a shirtless again. That way you'll see the big physical difference. And someone just came up to me and said, uh, how do I know you? And I said, do you go to the movies, watch TV, look at billboards on your drive, flip through magazines? Then you might know me. <laughs> anyway, I'm being funny again and anything else. You'll see a big difference or a big loss. Now I'm going to go, I'm going to tell you real quick, I'm going to go out on uh, my police academy story. This is dedicated to my dad who passed on, my dad who was old school. I'm up in Vancouver filming police academy, and it's raining every morning and every night. Uh, and I'm there for like eight months, and I'm the oldest guy in the cast, me and Joe Flaherty, the two oldest. Everyone else is like 18 years old. And this was a television series that was on Fox for like two seasons. But uh, So I'm up, we're filming in Vancouver. You go, we go to work at 5 in the morning in the dark. You come home in the dark. And it's raining. It rained every day for eight months. Well, maybe maybe almost every day. So my dad calls me after like eight, that's six months, and I'm talking to him, and he goes, "You sound down." And I said, "Yeah, yeah." I go to work in the dark, and, and it's raining. I come home in the dark, and it's raining. I says, "Man, I'm just really depressed." And my dad, okay, old school, goes, "Well, the checks cashing." I said, "Yeah." He goes, "Then shut your mouth. Buy yourself a raincoat and a flashlight." Ha ha ha. Anyway, that was my dad, man. Old school, old fashioned, which is the way we're doing it. The old way, man. Our way. All right? And um, let me just go out on now. Remember the inspirational phrase, God remembers for week five? And uh, God does remember, I promise. And I will see you at the top in week six. All right? 38 pounds the first month, baby boomers. God remembers. All right? I'm telling you he does. And, and let's be amazing again. All right? I promise. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs>